Crips. I'm getting a burrito, 60 cents for a can. I have some rewards here. Better than Qdoba or Chipotle. That's so cool. Good morning, guys. I'm here in Belgrade. I'm actually on my way to go visit a friend of mine. She's from Turkey, but she lives here in Belgrade, so she invited me to come hang out. But before I do that, I've got to buy a t-shirt because I had to throw a few of mine away because they were too old. First, I'm gonna go to this market and then probably get lunch or something and then go to my friends. Belgrade is a really busy city. There's lots of traffic, but it's pretty cool. There's always something new to see. You can really go adventuring around and explore for a really long time. There's always new stuff to find and lots of concrete things to climb on. It's pretty cool. This huge cathedral is one of the biggest Orthodox churches in the world and it happens to be here in Belgrade. It is also almost 100 meters tall. Last year they had a bunch of stands out here set up to buy t-shirts and everything, but there weren't really many right now so I couldn't find a t-shirt, but I'm gonna go check out a different market. That was pretty sick. That was the underground crypts beneath the church and that was the only part that we had access to because it's under construction. So unfortunately that second place didn't have what I was looking for either but it was kind of like a flea market so it was cool to check out some of that stuff. I miss this place. It's good to be back here again. It's one of my favorite cities. I'm glad to stay somewhere for more than just two or three nights you know. It'll be nice. So I'm in my friend Zarin's office here. That's Zarin. And she is getting ready for a podcast she's launching on YouTube. She's gonna be interviewing artists and talking to them about their art and their work and their projects and everything. And she's got some really cool plants. <laughs> We're gonna have this podcast interviewing and talking with artists more in a friendly way. It's not like Q&A. It's gonna be more about their personal life, how it affects their work, and everything else around it. Unfortunately, to do this, we need to um, make a Kickstarter campaign to collect some funds. So I have some rewards here that I would like to show. We're doing a collaboration with one of the local artists doing these amazing postcards and some other designs, which is interesting because she actually studied medicine. <laughs> and like, for instance, in this podcast, you'll be able to learn more about her, and I would like to learn more about her. <laughs> <laughs> and Anthony Brooks is making these VR headsets with animal faces. That's so cool. Besides this, the podcast uh, evolves around Eastern Europe, but not as a nationality case. 
more of like a landlock. So if you are from here, if you're based here, or if you're interested with Eastern Europe in general, you can part of, be part of this podcast. Of course, like you have to be some, doing something with art. There are a lot of other ways to incorporate art with different discipline, disciplines, which is what I'm doing with my initiative right now. I want to have multidisciplinary uh, art projects uh, because I believe art shouldn't be only for one type of people, but it should be able to reach to many people and should be uh, influenced or inspired by different disciplines. This is what I'm trying to provide in Belgrade right now. And the podcast will be the main <clears throat> highlight of this initiative, hopefully. <laughs> really cool to see somebody so passionate about what they're doing as well and starting a YouTube. Super cool. It was really nice to be able to catch up with Zaren. Haven't seen her in over a year actually, but yeah, she seems like she really is into what she's doing with her podcast and everything. I will put the links in the description for her social media and the videos and everything. I am happy to see another friend and especially another person who is doing creating and video YouTube work as well. It was a good afternoon. I just was doing some errands, walked around a bit. I just grabbed a beer, the local beer. Zycharsko. It's like 60 cents for a can. It's ridiculous. Later I'm going to be getting some super good food. I'm going to be getting a burrito. To my surprise they actually have burritos here. Last year I ate at this one place all the time and I plan on continuing to eat burritos every day. This is the balcony here. We're on the first floor. It is burrito time. Yes. Got the goods. I'm so hyped to eat this thing. I've missed Mexican food. That's probably what I miss most about America. I think this burrito is better than Qdoba or Chipotle. Hmm. Anyway, that's all I really got for today. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.